हेलो एवरीवन एंड वेलकम टू द कोर्स ऑफ टेरिस्ट्रल रेडियो इंटरफेसेस ऑफ 5G इन दिस कोर्स बाय टेलकोमा टेक्नोलॉजी वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द रेडियो इंटरफेसेस ऑफ द 5G टेक्नोलॉजी सो इन दिस कोर्स वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द रेडियो पार्ट सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद टेरिस्ट्रल रेडियो इंटरफेसेस ऑफ फाइव सो रेडियो इंटरफेस टेक्नोलॉजी द आई इंटरनेशनल Mobile Telecommunications 2020 specifications developed by third generation partnership project it consists of long term evolution LTE and NR which is new radio release 15 and beyond specification so 5G is basically a set of radio interface technologies it consisting of EUTRA or LTE as one component radio interface technology and new radio as another component radio interface technology so it consists of two in two technologies and two component RITs one is EUTRA or LTE and another one is new radio so these two components they are designed for operation in uh, like in imt spectrum so two components are there one is lt as one component and new radio as another component and they are designed for operation in the complete imt spectrum 5g technology fulfills the service and spectrum requirement here the both component rits lt and nr ye they utilize the frequency bands below 6 gigahertz and these bands are identified for imt in itu uh, radio regulations the new radio component rit can also utilize uh, this uh, bands above 6 gigahertz that is above 24.25 gigahertz the 3g pp 5g system also includes specification for its non radio aspects like core network elements security codex network management etc so component rit eutra or lt the first component it is based on release 15 and release 16 of lt and it encompasses both fdd and tdd the eutra lt component rit is based on release 15 and release 16 of lt using both frequency division duplex and time division duplex it uses fdd operation and it is applicable for operation with paired uh, paired spectrum and tdd operation it is applicable for operation with unpaired spectrum both this full duplex and half duplex fdd are supported in this and aggregation of tdd and fdd spectrum is also supported in this the transmission bandwidth up to 640 megahertz are supported in this downlink transmission scheme is based on conventional ofdm and uplink transmission uh, scheme is dft spread ofdm channel coding used is rate 1 by 3 turbo coding and complemented by hybrid automatic repeat request data modulation it supports qpsk 16 gram 64 gram 256 gram for both uplink and downlink it supports bandwidth with approximately 1.4 megahertz to 640 megahertz and narrow band iot supports 200 kilohertz bandwidth this is about the radio interface technology thank you